Good day, learners! I am Teacher Anne, and welcome to Telemas Aralan. This video was made with you in mind. It is here to help you assess your knowledge of the different mathematics concepts previously studied and your skills in performing mathematical problems. This knowledge and skills will help you understand one-to-one -one functions. As you go through this video, think of this important question. How one-to-one -one functions represents real-life situations? To find the answer, let's read and perform each activity. In this video, you are expected to demonstrate understanding of key concept of one-to-one -one functions. You should be able to apply concepts of one-to-one -one functions to formulate real-life problems with precision and accuracy. Let's study the graph in Figure 1. What will be the values of y in the table if x is negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, and 2. If x is negative 2, y is 4. If x is negative 1, y is 1. If x is 0, y is 0. If x is 1, y is 1. And if x is 2, y is Let's study the graph in figure 2. If x is negative 2, y is negative 2. If x is negative 1, y is negative 1. If x is 0, y is 0. If x is 1, y is 1. And if x is 2, y is 2. Two. As you can see in the first table, there are different values of x, but there are the same values of y. In the second table, all the values in both x and y are the same. If we will draw a horizontal line in the first figure, the horizontal line will intersect twice at the graph. If we will draw a horizontal line on the second graph, it will intersect only once. Remember that we can draw a horizontal line on any part of the graph to see how many times will the graph intersect the horizontal lines. If there is only one intersection or there are no the same values of y in the table of values, it is called a one-to-one -one function. Let's define what is one-to-one -one function. A function f is 1 to 1 if it never takes the same value twice or f of x of 1 is not equal to f of x of 2. That is, the same y value is never paired with two different x values. In the Venn diagram, function f is 1 to 1 since not two inputs have a common output. In the second Venn diagram, function f is not 1 to 1 since the inputs negative 1 and 0 have the same outputs. On the other hand, the function f of x equals x squared is not 1 to 1 function because f of 1 equals 1 and f of negative 1 equals 1. There are a lot of real-life applications of a one-to-one -one function. Now, determine whether the given relation is a function. If it is a function, determine whether it is one-to-one. -one. Example 1. The relation pairing a GSIS member to his or her GSIS number. Let's have the solution. If 
each GSIS member is assigned a unique GSIS number. Thus, this relation is a function. Further, two members cannot be assigned the same GSIS number. Therefore, the function is one-to-one. -one. Example 2. The relation pairing a citizenship to a person. The solution is, the relation is a function because each person has a citizenship. However, a person can have two citizenship. That is dual citizenship. Therefore, it is not a one-to-one. -one. Let's have the graph of a one-to-one -one function. If f is a one-to-one -one function, then no two points x sub 1 and y sub 1 and x sub 2 and y sub 2 have the same y value. Therefore, no horizontal line cuts the graph of the equation y equals f of x more than 1. Compare the two functions. The first figure is a graph of a sine function, while the second figure is a graph of a square root function. Both are functions. Now, let's determine which of the two functions is one-to-one -one function by using the horizontal line test. Figure 3 shows that the horizontal line and the graph intersects more than once. Therefore, it is not a one-to-one -one function. The horizontal line test of figure 4 intersects not more than once. Therefore, it is an example of a one-to-one -one function. How to determine if a function is one-to-one? -one? By using the horizontal line test. Wherein, a graph passes the horizontal line test if each horizontal line cuts the graph at most once. The function f is one-to-one -one if and only if the graph y equals f of x passes the horizontal line test. Let's have these two graphs. Both are rational function, but figure 5 shows that the horizontal line test intersects more than once, while the other horizontal line test intersect not more than once. It means figure 6 is an example of a one-to-one -one function. That's all for this session. I hope you learned the lesson in this session. Again, this is Teacher Anne signing off in our Telemath Aralan.